To create this design, I am going to add a cylinder with the 32 words. Then rotate this cylinder into 90 degree. Then shift A mesh, add a cylinder. And this time I will go with a 24 word cylinder. Go to the top view. Go to the date mode, turn on the extra mode. And select these words and right click connect vertex pair. Then select these faces and delete them. Select these words, go to the H mode and E to extrude it and move it along the Y axis in this way. And then press F to fill the gap. Now scale it down in this way and SC scale it along the Z axis. Now you need to align this vertical and this horizontal edges. So that's why you need to adjust the scale in this way. Try as much as you can. Then move it along the Y axis in this way. Now here, go to the edit mode and you need to add loop cut like this. And add one loop cut here. And on this cylinder, you need to add loop cut like this. Now I don't want this bottom part, so I will go to the edit mode. Select these words and move them along the Z axis in this way. Now select these two objects and then shift Q and use the boolean operation union. Then you need to apply this boolean modifier and then delete this cutter object. Now we need to create right topology for it. To create the topology for this design, I'm going to take the symmetry, go to the edit mode, select everything, mesh and symmetrize, take the symmetry. Then delete one half of the model, like this. Then you need to select these faces and then S, Y and give the value 0 and scale them along the Y axis. Then select everything, press M and merge by distance. So double words will get merged. And then you need to select these words and merge them at last. Like this. Then you need to use the knife tool and you need to create cut like this. And then you need to create a loop structure at here. So to create the loop structure, use the knife tool and create a loop structure like this. Then you need to select these words and merge them in this way. And just adjust the position of the words with the H slide. Then you can dissolve this H. Select everything, press M and merge by distance and then increase the merging distance. So any double words will be there that will merge. This loop structure is right, then delete these faces. Then select this H and press F to fill the gap and now we are getting right loop structure. Add one loop cut here. Select this word and use the H slide. Then I need to add one loop cut here. And then just select this edges and use the H slide on them. So you can get a loop structure right there. Now select these words and move them along the Z axis in this way. Then select everything, mesh and symmetrize. Take the symmetry. And then you can select these faces. Use the insert operation, then select this H loop and Ctrl B add bevel on it. Give the proper bevel width, select this H loop and Ctrl B add bevel on it. Add it to segment bevel and shape factor should be 1 and give the proper bevel width. Then select this face, select this face and use the insert operation. And right click bridge H loop. Select this H loops and Ctrl B add bevel on them. Use the knife tool and create cut like this. And then this loop cut will go, it will travel in this way. Use the knife tool and create cut like this. And then connect this words. Then create vertical cuts in this way. Then select these faces and use the insert operation like this. And then dissolve this H. Select everything, mesh and symmetrize, take the symmetry and create cut in this way then create cut like this then you can select this edge loop and control B add bevel on it add one segment bevel add one loop cut here and then select these faces use the insert operation and use the insert operation one more time and then merge these words at the center then dissolve this edge Select these words and merge them at last. And now this loop structure is not accurate here. Select everything, press M and merge by distance. So double words will get merged. Then use the knife tool and create cut like this. And then connect in this way. 
and then you can dissolve this age and then dissolve this ages dissolve this ages select these faces use the insert operation in this way then add one loop cut here and add few loop cut add one loop cut here use the knife tool and create cut then you can dissolve this age loop also and you will get this kind of loop structure select everything mesh and symmetry take the symmetry here you can see i'm getting this kind of loop structure then hit the control 2 and add the sub d modifier and shade smooth it here you can see the smooth form and the shading you can see the topology so that's it for today thanks for watching if you like this tutorial then hit that like button and subscribe to youtube channel bye bye so next video take care